We are learning new details tonight on the charges filed against the mom of a five year old boy who was hit and killed during a hit and run crash while riding an electric scooter earlier this week. Prosecutors charged her with negligent homicide. They also charged the driver who left the scene. News on Six's Justin Schreyer is live with the new information. Justin. And tonight, police say that the mom was negligent by riding the electric scooter with her son and disobeying traffic laws, which contributed to her son's death. This was the scene just minutes after five year old Caden Reyes Ortiz was hit and killed by a vehicle near 31st in Riverside. Court documents say Caden's mother, Evelyn Ortiz, was riding an electric scooter with her son zigzagging into oncoming traffic. And when she swerved to avoid a car, Caden fell off and was hit. The driver, Rainier Davison, turned himself in the next day. He's charged with leaving the scene of a deadly accident, having a suspended license, and causing an accident without a valid driver's license. Sadly, I wasn't surprised. Um, having watched literally out my office window for the past six months since scooters have come to Tulsa, I've seen people engage in incredibly reckless behavior. Attorney Gerald Jackson says people need to understand the risks involved and abide by the rules. Bottom line is you are essentially assuming the risk and assuming liability and you're waiving liability against the, the owners of the, the scooter. Some of Lyme's rules and regulations say you must wear a helmet, follow all traffic laws, and only one rider is allowed at a time. Tulsa also has ordinances in place that cover where you can park scooters to where you can ride them. Some riders tell me they did not even read the rules before taking off. Used the little app and downloaded the scooter and took off. Others were more detailed. You gotta be 18, you're supposed to be wearing a helmet, stuff like that. Jackson says the bottom line is to use common sense. It's not child's play. They need to, to be more serious and think about what they're doing. And next, and next week, the city council will be discussing scooter safety. Live in Tulsa, Justin Schreyer, Oklahoma's own News on 6.